Hello guys, KP Shamino here with a new video for Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2, the playtest. And Friday we got the new area, so the new river in uh, Slovakia. And uh, I fished here already, I think for six levels. I made some nice amount of money. At the start it was not that easy because it's totally different fishing than in Poland. In Poland you can just stay at one position and just get the entire day very nice carp. But that's not really the case here. So you need to watch a little bit what you do here because it's not... You stay at one position, you catch like three fish that you can stay on that position. So you need to move around. So I prepared for you guys a small rotation and I will show you guys that live at the end. But first we are going to start with the setup. So what did I read? Uh, so that this river is shallow water, that's true. So that means it's shallow water, you can stand everywhere in the water. And if you catch a fish with a low setup and he's fighting too hard, you can just run through the fish and get the fish out of the water. Uh, so the setup does not matter that much test wise uh, what matters is what you need to use that was in the patch notes too top water works here the best so that's what we are going to use so let's get started first with the setups so there is one big problem at the moment i bought myself a new setup you guys can see it here but it seems that really is not working so it's totally off so uh, i got the reel that is eight kilogram i got the line that is eight kilogram and it breaks on 10% of my drag. So it's off, it's a bug, it's broken. So don't buy it until they fix it because that was around 7,000 currency that I spent and it does not work. So I'm fishing with this setup. So I'm using the universal nine kilogram. That's not really needed. Of course, go with the starting one. Let me have a look where he is. I got probably one over here, this one. So this is a starting one, the three and a half kilogram. That's more than enough. You don't need to have more. Uh, then you use this one. This is starting two. I'm testing now with eight and a half kilogram. The funny part, this setup is a little bit stronger than if I use here four kilogram. Don't ask me why, probably because there is half of a kilogram that I execute more. But at the moment, the setup is a mess. Don't just ignore it uh, because you cannot make a good setup. That's the main problem. So you guys, of course, can use the four kilogram. It's more than enough. And then for the setup. So if you come here as a level three, uh, go with this. Uh, yeah, of course, I don't have it at the moment. Start with the bugs. So what are the bugs? It's this. So you go to the shop, you go to baits, and then you go to the bug. Uh, this one, the yellow works really well. There is not really a difference. I tested a lot of them. And I tried the, the, the most expensive. I tried the yellow. At the end, you catch... A lot of fish and you catch with every bug the same amount of fish. It's just what is changing that's the bite. Because you can see the fish moving around. Uh, but I cannot say there is something better than something else. This is going to catch a lot smaller fish. Because it's 1.4 gram. And then the other one that I'm using is this one. This is 10.5 gram. That's what I saw. So if you use this you're going to get bigger fish. So bigger lures are bigger fish. That's true. But if you come here, start with the bug. It does not really matter. I always fish with the yellow black. Take that one on the setup that I showed you guys. So what can you get here? So this is uh, fishing for me, I think, 10 minutes. You guys can see there is a lot of money here. There is a lot of experience. So if you get brown trout, that is 10 kilogram or Atlantic salmon. You can see it here, my brown trout, 12 kilogram. It's 220 currency. Uh, so uh, you can make the money here. And uh, yep, that's it. So let's get started, guys. So first of all, I'm going to show you guys now what I'm doing. So yeah, one day they are going to fix it that I don't always. Ah, okay. So let's go fishing. Uh, you can unlock this, by the way, at level three. So you need to go to Slovakia. And what I'm doing is I alternate between evening fishing and between cloudy and overcast because... I'm not sure it's already in the game. Maybe I'm just saying bullshit. That's possible too. But I always think that uh, trout and salmon, they like it a little bit more cold. So I don't think that full sun is very good for them. And I go to the evening when the temperature is going a little bit down. So we are going to start now on a cloudy. So if, <coughs> if the rotation is done and you see that it dries up really quick, 
what you can do is you just exit and you go back. I always do that. Sometimes it works and sometimes it don't work. So, but I just do it or just restart the game. So let's get started and I'm going to cough for a brief moment. Okay, sorry for that. My uh, my voice is a little bit fucked up because I need to work really hard in the weekends, uh, physical wise. So let's get uh, started. So we are going to fish. So I'm fishing on two pegs, and we are going to start with the first peg. I'm going to show you guys uh, what you need to do. So what can you do? So you start here at peg number one. That's uh, that's over here, and you can right away start fishing here. So, uh, and you can stand everywhere here, so that's what I'm meaning. If you come here with a very small setup, and your fish is fighting too hard, just run uh, towards him, and just get the fish. I always like to stand a little bit back, because the fish is biting everywhere. So, you guys see, uh, you guys see here a rock, and you guys see here a rock. Everything in between is going to create some fish. There is a spawn point, and the fish is going around. So that's what you need to do, and I need to watch it for a little moment because I'm not at the right position. I'm most of the time standing over here. So what is the speed that you need to do? So with my setup, I can go to 90% if you go with the starting setup uh, without the, the, the higher rod. You need to go with 80%, otherwise you break your rod. So I can go with 90, but if you are using the 3.5, kilogram rod go with 80 percent you need to go with speed 28 and that's it and another thing that i saw and they need to fix that you need to see how this rod throws so i'm now pointing to the rock i just throw and you need to see where it lands so that's totally off uh it's it's crazy but that's very irritating because i wanted to be a lot more to the right of the rock so there is yeah a lot of uh yeah, miss, miss throwing that you do in this area. You can fix it because you can move your rod the moment that, uh, that you throw. But that's not the case. They need to fix it. If I want to throw on that position, I want to throw on that position. I don't want to throw 10 meters to the other side. It's always left, by the way. So um, that's a crazy, crazy thing. So let's have a look that it's active. Sometimes it can take a little bit. You're not going to catch non-stop fish with this setup. Uh, so always remember that because this is the 10 gram. So let's do a click. This is a lot better it seems. Or was it? No, it was once again a lot to the left. So you throw on that position a little bit to the right of the rocks. If it is not producing, you just go to the other rock. If it is not producing, we go to the next spot. It can take some time. The fish are swimming around. That's the problem here. So it's not never think this is fishing planet. I think this is a very good system. So you, you need to move a little bit around, but you're practically casting. If you got a good position, you, you can catch everywhere fish in a certain area. That's a lot more fun, but you need to re-throw. Don't think that you can say, okay, I throw 100 million times on this spot, and I'm going to catch the entire time fish. That's not the case. You guys can see it. Now it's that. The previous time that I was here, I had now already three fish. So now we are going to throw to the rock. To have a look that rock is a little bit more active, the older one. And once again, there goes my... So, yeah. It's uh, it's in my book already that they need to fix this problem. Uh, because it's not fun. That, that it's always throwing so far away from the position that you want to throw. So let's have a look that here is a fish. Yeah, there is one. Okay. And you guys can see, they are, this is not a fighter, and you can run towards the fish and just get it in. So that's what you can do. Let's go a little bit back. A Hutchin, this one. Let's keep this fellow 33 experience. Let's do one cast more. But always remember, always remember, there is not uh, a standard that says you will catch always the same amount of fish. You catch a lot of fish. Uh, you can uh, yeah, do something about the weight with just going higher with the lure. But the bite is always at a decent level. But sometimes it's very high and sometimes it's a little bit less. Always remember that. 
So, uh, but if you do this, you will catch a lot of fish. I got sometimes days too, that I think by myself, fuck, I'm not catching fish. Reset the area, go to the other spot, and that works. Here is a nice fish. This is Atlantic Salmon, 5 kilogram. Very nice fish. Let's keep the... Oh. Ah, my fishing net is full. Okay, we are going to sell it for a brief moment. Let's release this fish. Let's sell really quick the net. That's a lot of money that I got in the net. I think it's almost 1000 even more. That's good. I'm not sure what I'm going to buy because the main problem is that the new setups, they are fucked up. So I'm just going to keep the money, maybe try a little bit more lures. So you guys can see what I did. Spot 1 was not producing that much. I just go a little bit to the right. Keep fishing until it's dry too and then we are going to the next spot. That's what you need to do and take it from me. I leveled here I think 7 levels or even 8 levels in I think 5 hours of play. I made around 10,000 currency in 5 hours of play. So you can make some nice money, you can make some nice experience. It's not the same like Poland. I got the impression that lure fishing is a little bit harder. And that's understandable because you're not using baits. So somewhere they need to find a very good balance and uh, that's uh, very important. So that was spot number two and now I'm going to show you guys spot number uh, three. That's here at the bridge. Very uh, known position. So a lot of people fish here. I see a lot of people saying that they fish right of the bridge. You can just stand here, throw to the rock and you do just the same. And uh, sometimes it's very fun with the shallow water here. You see the fish swimming. So if the if the moment is here that you see a very big fish swimming around you, expect some bites. Uh, so uh, that's... Yeah, then you know, okay, there is... Here we go. So that's already three fish. I did now six casts. So only spot number one was not producing. But here this is, and they are very nice uh, graphic-wise. I like the rot. If you see this brook trout... It's a small one, but, but they got other colors too. So if you go to the spa, small uh, brook trout, they are a little bit more uh, green. And then they become more and more yellow. So if you got a very big one, they are more brown yellow. Uh, so you see, that's always cool that they do that. That's, that's very nice, I need to say. Because where is the time that if you catch a 100 gram or a 5 kilogram fish, it was all the same. But now, uh, most of the games, they got that in, the, in their system. That the colors change when they get bigger. At the start of the fishing games, I never saw that. But now it's so common. that uh, Here is another one, Hutchin. Yeah, it's a small fan. Hutchin, I think, is Tamen, if I'm not mistaken. I think they are just the same fish. Because I'm not sure how you pronounce it. I think that the guy of... Uh, what is the program? That, uh, that very famous Fisher guy. I think that he pronounced it Hucken. So I'm not sure how you say it. Hutchen or Hucken. It depends a little bit, I guess. But I think it's just Taman. And I think that Taman, everybody says it's the same, so... So that's already how many fish do we got now? Five or something? Still all small fish. Because what are very good fish? Everything above 10 kg. I think the Atlantic can go to 70 to 18 kg. My record is 14 kg. Uh, but uh, the, the brown trout, if you get a 10 kg, very nice fish. You guys saw it in my net. And you see now, it's, it's, not, it's a little bit drying up. So you can do a couple of more casts. So that's what is going to happen. That's always the case. Never expect that you catch like 100 fish after each other every cast. No, this is the case. If you go with the bug, of course, it goes a little bit better because it's smaller. Uh, but uh, here, that's cool. Do you guys see this brown trout in front of me? Sometimes if you come close enough, they turn around and you see them fighting for the lure. Because you can see it here really uh, good. So it's very shallow here. There, oh, nice. Just in time, another Taman. And this is a nice one. This is a very nice one. He fights a little bit. Let's have a look. Here we go. Yeah, it's 7.6. Almost 100 currency and 200 experience. So one more, guys, and then I'm going to end the video. I cannot say more. If you do this, you make a lot of levels. Uh, it's... Uh, it's not a bad lake, but I was more fan of the second lake. Uh, don't ask me why. 
Uh, but if you like spin fishing, this is god heaven, I think, for uh, for uh, for spin fishing, guys. So try top waters here, the same that I try. You could see try a bug. You can go to the what is it? F ninety five. That's something else. But I guess if you just go higher, you get bigger fish. That's the only difference. Try to go with uh, speed 28 that you got a green dot. For the guys that are realistic mode. And this is a bug too. This is going to happen a lot. I call it helicopter fish. It's not really a problem because you get the fish in. If you keep trying. But uh, it's a bug. This is the helicopter flying uh, fish. Uh, so yeah, that was it guys. So if it dries up, I go back to position 1. If the entire area dries up, I do a reset or I restart the game. And I go again. And you guys can see, this is what I made in the video. So it's around 110. And I already sold two other fish too. So thanks for watching guys. Have fun. Bye bye.